Biostatistics is a field of science that helps investigate biological data through statistical method. It is a field that has made easier to study life sciences and medicine and has resolved and addressed a multitude of factors. So if you are among one of them and wanted to contribute to the scientific community, then you could be the next biostatistician. So hey everybody, this is Ria from Biotechnica. So the topic for today will be biostatistics as a career, its use and its scope. So let's dive into its detail. So the first is introduction. So biostatistics is a field which is used to analyze data and also communicate to the scientific findings. So if you're working as a biostatistician in clinical findings, you are definitely going to reduce the chances of biased outcome. Now, why there is a need to study biostatistics? And the next topic is why should you study biostatistics? So biostatistics is a field that provides you with a good career opportunity for all those students who wanted to work as a public health expert and wanted to contribute to the scientific community and wanted to facilitate the quantitative research and who are concerned about the public health. So if you're working as a biostatistician uh, abroad and if you're finding a job overseas, then your annual package will be a $90,000 to $1 lakh. So you will be getting an annual package of this. And if you're working in India, then the Indian currency, you will be getting an annual package of rupees 10 lakh to 12 lakh per annum. So this is just the salary you are working if you're working as a biostatistician in any of the company or you can say organization. So you will also face an annual growth of 15 to 20%. So it's a highly paid career in the field of public healthcare facilities as well as research center. Now, what is the importance of biostatistician? So suppose if you have pursued your MSc in biostatistics specifically, now what's the importance of biostatistician? So the tools and techniques of biostatistics has developed a variety of variables to unravel any of the biological data, where biostatistician, they develop many of the mathematical models to qualify or to improve the outcome of any of the data where they are involved in assessing the uh, scientific data. They are also involved in formulating any of the novel mathematical concepts, theories and rules specifically in the field of epidemiology as well as clinical medicine. And they are also involved in the diagnostic evaluation of any of the biological samples where they identify a causative agent for a particular disease. And also they are involved in the development of innovative communication channels where they con uh, contribute and communicate through the scientific community. Now, what are the job duties and roles? So as a biostatistician, you have to uh, pursue and you have to function for all these uh, job duties and roles that are mentioned here. So you can call it as a job responsibility as a biostatistician. So let's see what are the job roles and duties if you're working and if you have pursued your MSc in biostatistics and if you are looking for a job. So you will be looking for and working for gene set enrichment analysis. You will be working for a linear discriminant analysis. You will be working for a developing on any kind of hypothesis correlation and ultimately logistic regression method. You will be de developing and evaluating gene expression method. You will be working for mass spectrometry as well in any of the lab or you can say institute. You will also be collaborating with DNA microarrays experiment. Now, what is the application of biostat uh, biostatistics? So once you study this, where you can apply, so where you can actually apply, these fields are given here. So all these are applications in the following domain where young uh, biostatistician, they can expand their career on the basis of their academics, uh, qualification that they have and also their skills. So these are all fields where you can actually apply for a job. So once you have pursued your master's, you can go for all these fields and apply for a job. So the application of biostatistics is all the domains that is mentioned here. The first is quantitative genetics, where you can perform a quantitative research on genetics. The second is personalized medicine, which is the most, or you can say the ongoing and the advanced research that is going on, that is personalized medicine for any kind of disease, for for an individual. The third is internal medicine. You can also work in this field. The fourth is healthcare management of the public where the biostatistician is concerned about the public health. Fifth is health policy development. You can work in this area as well. The sixth is environmental health. The next is nutrition. 
Next is health services research. You can also uh, perform any kind of research and analyze any data for health services research that is going on. Epidemiology, population dynamics, system biology, biological sequence assessment and ecological forecasting. So these are just the field and the domains that are listed here. So you can work and apply all your knowledge in all these fields. So the next is, if you're working as a biostatistician in clinical studies, now what will be your opportunities if you're working specifically for a clinical data? So here you will be auditing and validating many of the research findings. So suppose if you're working in any lab, so what all research data they have uh, done? So they have got some research data out of their research. So you have to audit and validate all the research findings that have been given by the scientific community, or you can say the research professionals. The Second is you will be developing some kind of statistical method so as to improve the production of drugs as well as medical equipment. Suppose if lab is working on any kind of development of drugs for a particular disease. So you have to utilize your statistical method and you have to develop a novel mathematical model so as to improve the production of that drug from a particular source. The next is evaluating the mechanism of action and effectiveness of a novel drug target. Suppose if anyone is working on a drug where they are targeting a organ. So suppose if they have designed or they have developed a drug X named X and if they are targeting a particular op uh, organ for treating that particular disease. So here they will be uh, developing such kind of uh, you can say the ways and networks where you will be identifying and evaluating the mechanism and action of that drug and how that drug can be more effective. So these are some of the opportunities or you can say application of biostatistician or you can say when they apply their biostatistics specifically in the field of medicine or you can say clinical studies. Now what is the worth of a career in biostatistics? So is biostatistics that important? Yes, it is that important because biostatistics help you to establish a stable and progressive career in the field of pharmaceutical sciences, pharmaceutical industry, in field of academics, as well as contract research organization. So if you have any kind of contract with the research organization, so you can have that stable and progressive career. Where the analytical skills and communication skills of higher biostatistician help them to gain the financial incentives as well as the appraisal. So this is just a wow job where you can get financial incentives as well as appraisals. Where you are working as a collaborators with the scientific community and you are working in different different labs means you are analyzing their data and you are working as a collaborator means you are working to improve for public health and you are concerned here for a public health and you are working in the area of public sector. Now, what are the career opportunities that you can get after studying or pursuing this MSc or Master's in Biostatistics? So you can go for, we have just seen the applications where you can apply your knowledge. We have just seen the field. Now, what are the uh, post or you can say the job roles that you can actually get after studying this MSc or Master's in Biostatistics? So the first is pharmaceutical firm. So you can go for any of the pharmaceutical company and apply for a, a job as a biostatistician. The next is medical school. So you can also go for these medical schools. The third is research organization. As we have already discussed, you have to work with the scientific community. You have to analyze the result, whatever they have got out of their research, whether it is any of uh, epidemiology lab or it is protein, uh, you can say the drug target lab. So any of the lab, you have to just coordinate with them and work for this research organization. The next is hospital. You can go to the hospital. You can work as a biostatistician and you can analyze all the data that is of the patient sample. The next is clinical setting. You can also work for this clinical data as well. The next is federal agencies, laboratories. Again, laboratories, you will be dealing with many of the clinical samples and many of the data. So you have to analyze all those data at particular timing. So this is just a work of biostatistician. The next is lecturer and professor. So if you have just pursued your MSc in biostatistics and if you wanted to uh, teach somewhere and if you have passion for teaching, so you can literally go for a lecturer or a professor job where you can be appoint yourself as a professor and teach for them. So this is just about the career opportunities. So here we have seen what is biostatistics, why it is actually important, why there is a need to study biostatistics, there is a need to evaluate the biological samples to assess any kind of scientific data. This is the very biggest advantage that you can say that is related or associated with biostatistics.
and the last is developing communication channels throughout the country throughout the organization and among all the scientific community also we have discussed the job duties and role what job duties and role they actually have what is the application of biostatistics after we study how to apply for this biostatistics application the next is application or expanding opportunity if you are applying your biostatistics models and tools and techniques specifically in the field of clinical studies we have seen that also we have seen what is the worth of career in biostatistics that is it is a stable and progressive career in any of the organization in pharmaceutical company in academics and also in contract research organization and at last we have seen the career opportunities what all career opportunities you will have after pursuing your masters in biostatistics so this is all for this topic so i hope this information was beneficial for all those aspirants who have done their biostatistics and looking for an opportunity in any of the organization or institute so if you like the uh, information please like share and subscribe to our channel that is biotechnica meet you in the next video until next time this is your host riya from biotechnica till that time take care happy learning